In this video, we'll use the Join tool in Alteryx to merge two datasets together. Prior to recording this video, I added some basic documentation to my Alteryx workflow to make it easier to refer to tools and steps. Let's use the Join tool to join the Personal Property Asset list created in Part 2 to the Personal Property Depreciation Table Half-Year Convention created in Part 3. Scroll over and down until you have some blank space on your canvas. Drag the Join tool from the Join menu until it is in front of Step 6. Make a manual connection from the T for True output anchor from Step 6 filter tool to the L for Left input anchor of the Join tool. Make a manual connection from the output anchor for Step 10 select tool to the R for Right input anchor of the Join tool. Now that we have both steps connected, we can configure the Join tool. Leave the radio button for Join by Specific Field selected. Click the drop-down arrow under Left and select Recovery Year. The box under Right should automatically populate with Recovery Year. If not, you can click on the drop-down arrow and select Recovery Year. As a hint, if the right box does not auto-populate, check that your spelling of recovery year matches. Remove unwanted or duplicate fields by unchecking the box next to right recovery year. And scroll down and uncheck the box next to unknown. Save and run your Alteryx workflow. Click on the J output anchor and verify that the join worked properly, such that assets have the appropriate depreciation percentage for the recovery year. Good job! In the next video, you'll learn how to use the formula tool in Alteryx to create a conditional formula that will compute the current year depreciation for each asset.